Hello, Jerry. This is Dave from David Michael Designs and ChiefTutor.com. Hey, um, I took a look at your plan on Chief Talk because I was really interested in, in those walls. I've had many times I've had problems with walls sticking out through roofs and things like that. That's that's pretty common with Chief, and you just have to kind of get used to how Chief builds stuff. But when I was looking at yours, I found all kinds of weird things like the Z-fighting of the foundation walls happening in your attic walls. Very, very strange things like that, and uh, the foundation being built out and things like that. So it was quite unique. Uh, I think I have a solution for you. Now, I have built, or I am running on X8, not X7. I know yours is X7. So that's why I thought I'd make this video to show you how I fixed it. Um, because I can't send you back the plan, you couldn't open it in your version. Okay, so the first thing I would do is always build your foundation last. So let's go to the zero floor and let's delete the foundation. Uh, delete foundation that takes care of all our immediate problems downstairs now upstairs we still have in the attic wall all these walls being generated and i want you to take a look at some of this stuff see the dark lines that are here and this lighter dash line so this is an invisible wall and then there's a foundation wall there's a foundation wall so these are like markers the chief is telling you that there's this is all foundation wall these should just be standard attic walls not foundation walls so that's uh, the first issue that i saw um, so what I'm going to do is try to fix all these attic walls. Let's uh, go down to the first floor, and we'll notice the same thing about these invisible walls, the porch that you built. So I'm just going to delete these bad boys. That would be the easiest way to do this. Just delete them straight out. Now, we could fix them one at a time, but I think it's going to be easier just to delete them. And we'll go back upstairs, and um, let's delete, like, this wall that's being generated, this wall that's being generated, because it it shouldn't be generated. Now see, it's it's still being generated over here, which is very, very strange. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to fix your defaults because I'm noticing your walls are generating incorrectly. So let's go to my wall tool, and if you just double click on your wall tool, your exterior wall tool, you'll see that you have foundation checked for your exterior walls. So you don't want that. You want to normally uncheck that so it doesn't run like that. Also go to your invisible walls, double click that, and go into your structure tab, general tab again and remove the foundation wall. So you can just draw straight easy invisible walls. Now I'm going to come back upstairs here and I'm going to try to fix this wall. It is still generating funny which is real weird. Okay, so the best way to do this now is let's, I'm going to grab both of these um, Excuse me, a little alarm went off. I'm going to grab both of these um, corbels that you have, and I'm going to move them out of the way. Say 300 feet over to the right. That way I can shift select all these things. I'm probably going to lose your window, but I'll put that back. So just shift select all your attic walls and delete them. And they'll be regenerated by Chief. And notice they're regenerated without the foundation marker, so we know we're on the right path. Now shift select all of them again. Open them back up and make sure you have that selected as an attic wall and none of them are invisible and click OK. And again, it'll give you some warning that you're generating. Now I've kind of corrected the model a little bit better here. So if we go into our 3D view, we can see that we have the correct walls kind of being generated. Uh, the colors are gone, but we can replace those quite easily. Um, but everything else looks good. Nothing's sticking through the roof. There's no, like, weird generated things going on underneath and things like that. Okay. So let's go back downstairs, and let's just complete our pattern by going to invisible walls. And now that you have foundation removed from invisible walls, we can rebuild this porch area. So we'll go in here, go in here, go up to here around there up and down all around and then grab this one and move it in because I noticed you wanted a, a ceiling on this side of the porch and then vaulted on that right so those settings should still stay the same and we'll move in a little bit better and you know what's throwing me off is I forgot those darn corbels that I sent packing didn't I <laughs> so shift select both of those bad boys go back here make a negative 300 feet that puts them back on the plan. I'm happy there. Go downstairs, go back to 3D. And again, I'm going to have to put your window back. I think I got everything else going. So let's go to the spray can and your plan materials. And whoa, so let's purge out the ones we don't need. 
Um, gonna try to find what was it, a shiplap or something. I think it was your sighting. So I'm gonna just look for it. I believe it was Coco. Coco Cabana. Da -da -da -bana. You ever see that show, um, Parks and Recreation? On uh, I think it was NBC. It is a hilarious show. There we go. That show is funny because there was a main character in the show, and his name was Gary, and everybody called him Jerry, and then pretty soon they'd call him Terry, and then every time he'd say something, they would make fun of him, and like, you know, like, stupid Jerry, you don't know what you're talking about. That show is just hilarious. You might get a kick out of watching that, you know, just for giggles. Okay, so I'm going to spray this bad boy. I spray this bad boy, go over to my windows, and put in a window that I messed up on, and again, that wall is really frustrating me. This wall should not be generating. And it's still generating. <laughs> That's not good. That's not good at all because I'm trying to put a window in. Oh, so now I can put the window in because I made it invisible and it's low enough now. So now it's good. Okay, so now I'm going to go to 24, I don't know, 48. I don't know. Um, I think you had it arched so we'll break up the arch and then we'll put in uh, lights i think you had lights in the upper part only and i believe you had it uh, stained this color and you had the brick on that color right something like that okay so now we can see it's nice and clean all the way around i mean everything's just generating beautifully I think that solves the problem. Again, the foundation automatically generates with Chief, which is nice, but you can also build your own foundation in there. One thing I noticed with your plan on your foundation walls, or if I go into this wall that you use for your exterior walls and I define it, I see that it's set to foundation to exterior of layer, layer one, which is this brick layer. So that means that if I went to my foundation tool, build foundation and I said build a monolithic slab and click OK and then go to my 3D view I'll notice that my slabs are way outside that wall mm, that's not what I like I don't like it at all so I'm going to go to wall types and define it and change the definition to generate on 5 layer 5 where this framing is that makes sense right sense to me now in order to correct it we simply have to generate a new foundation again so we're going to say build foundation monolithic slab click OK I don't care the old ones will get lost it says but boom it went ahead and fixed it so there you go there is your cabin all fixed and again I'm not sure which stone color you wanted to use if it's gonna be this one here I mean, we can apply it across and Try to keep them the same color everywhere. But that's easy enough. Now in 7, when you spray paint walls, it spray paints all the walls. So um, be careful of that when you do that. 8's nice because you spray, tape, spray paint one little section, and it gets just that one little section. I need a little fix with X8, which is good. Okay. So that's been messing with the cabin here with Jerry's Cabin here at Chief Talk slash davidmichaeldesigns.com.